Hello, board members. How are we doing this evening? Hope you had a nice weekend. Oops. Um, ladies intro, welcome. Ica, welcome. How you doing? How is the, uh, the great Snapple debacle of uh, 2021 going? OSR, welcome. How you doing? Hope you have a good weekend. A, a haircut? Why? My hair hasn't been cut in nearly 15 years. Woo! Yes, yes, I did get a haircut. Uh, it was due. It was way due. That's actually the longest I've ever let my hair grow. To For be completely as long honest. As we um, could remember. Um, and that's actually why I grew it out. I'm like, well, quarantine. I've never had long hair before. <laughs> Quitter. Yeah, it, uh, <laughs> I have very curly hair, so, like, anytime I would bend over, it would just go right in my eyeballs, and it was terrible. It was just, it was just the worst. Like, honestly, just, just the worst. Let's see. This one? It's that one. Oh, wait. Hold on one second. Hold on, hold on. Let's go back to this. What am I? Oh, this. That's what I'm missing. That's what I'm missing. All right. Uh, let me, hold on. Hold on. Let me make sure that looks. In, it's looking good. Looking good. Okay. Yeah, that looks better. All right. Uh, so we started uh, last week after finishing up. Um, uh, let's see. So after finishing up um, Dark Souls, we started Darkest Devotion. Our dark devotion, which we began last week. Uh, this is day two, or try two. It is very interesting. It has a bit of a learning curve, but we're getting there. We defeated one boss on our first try and then lost to the second boss with one hit left on him on our first try. So we're, we're getting there. Okay, let's see. Oh, it got... So I can actually have good news about the Snapple. My coworker actually came in today and helped me with that awful palette my bad coworker left mine. That's a great... You know, little little mercies in the universe, right? Let's see, OSR. I'm currently rocking the ponytail. Still looking for a good solution for sleep, though. Uh, see, that worked out for me because I sleep on my stomach, so I don't have night terrors or what is it? So I don't have sleep paralysis or snore like a chainsaw, like an active chainsaw, and not just like idling chainsaw where it's like burr, 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 burr. it's like burr, burr. like it's a horrific. Yeah, it's 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 not okay. Okay, so what did we learn? We learned we have no no jump button. Um, I'm honestly trying to remember. And I think all my healing stuff's on the D-pad. I've got to remember the buttons. Hello, friendo. Uh, we were using the great sword, but we were thinking about maybe switching over to the so-so sword or okay sword or the stick of decency. Oh, yeah, we unlocked... This is that first boss weapon we got from beating... 15% 15 chance to miss, but really good good damage. Is there a way to, like, assign it? Because if we took the... Yeah, that just becomes our primary. Yeah, we can only get primaries. Let's take the, the big child's rattle. Got some restless leg syndrome. Always tossing and turning. Ah, fair. That's understandable. These these strange times that we live in with the, the restless leg syndrome. Carrying the stone will prevent defeated bosses from spawning again. Crumbling it will bring you back to the filth bloods. Crumbling it will bring you back to... Oh, okay. So that's just our way out, basically. Okay. Oof, that's a... Uh, that's like a truck. Okay. Ooh, interesting. So it has a block or a parry, but it actually has a delay for it going away. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, this will be interesting to see if I can get the, I can use this on the boss fight. Okay. And then. Oh. Okay. There's the map. Okay. So. Yeah. This is the big. This is the big bonk and stick. All right. The morose goth. Is that you? <laughs> um. So, this map is all over the place. So here's the first boss we defeated on our first try. And this is the one we almost defeated on our first try, but not quite. Almost, though. Almost. Um, 
This is the one we have not had. A, we have not even fought the main boss. We keep getting killed by his minions. Uh, how do I go down there? Let's go fight the minion boss. Had a friend while in the Air Force who had otherworldly snoring. Oof. Yeah, I, I believe it. I mean, it, it's crazy, but... Uh, yeah. I have incredibly, like, small little nostrils, and it just it does not work for sleeping. All right, so we want to go... So we have one here that's, like, a question mark for some reason, unless that's supposed to be... Yeah, no, ancient tablet, it's unknown. Yeah, so we still kind of need to go get that one. And then if we go down instead of the right, we can go down here. Looks like I can try our hand at this boss again. This is a very confusing map. All right. Well, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Uh, oh, yeah, that's how we switch weapons. Like, there's a certain uh, niceness to just the... Ooh, that should have hit me. Oh, yeah, um... Jumping and rolling is less physically tiresome, and the auto seems to be smiling and carrying it makes you feel better. Stamina regen, okay. Yep, and then we got... Oh, there was like a third hit in there for some reason. That was weird. Okay, so what we want to do is we need to go down, right? Uh, this one, it doesn't matter, down or up. Right now, the biggest issue is we don't have a way across to that tablet yet. Bandages. It's not X. Why? Um, that brothers, I got in a fight with one super strong knight and a bunch of weak ranged units in the swamp. So I turned their knight into a zombie, and I'm watching it slowly chase archers around, running very slowly in the swamp. Park. Wow, that does sound uh, his, like hysterical, um, like a weird Benny Hill skit. You are not wrong. Oh yeah, this is the forgiveness guy. Where if we upset somebody, he'll forgive us. So they will stop attacking us, I presume. So we haven't figured out how to get over here yet. Where the, we see we have this guy, and presumably a little further over is the uh, tablet we need. I don't know if we unlock ability or what, but... Oh. <laughs> Oh, we got him. And these are just generic swords, right? Yeah, those are just the old swords. So we go this way. No? Nothing. Alright. We'll go this way. Hi, he caught up to one. Oh, no! That, uh, that archer is donezo, I would say. Uh, take these. They're weird, but, I mean, they're something, right? I think this is the way you go, and we haven't mass figured out how to get all of the buttons yet. Because we, we found a note mentioning that one of these walls is fake, but we don't know which one. We haven't figured that part out. Oh, we one-shotted that guy. Oof. Now I think this is the one that we want to... Nope, I guess it is. I'm sure that... I'm sure that that archer was turned into a fine paste. Am I right? Oh, myth spark curiosity within the first par parish. I'm of the opinion that deals are mere tales and legends that describe the history of our gods. Indeed, are what blasphemy, what a mistake. I've been looking out for the, like, lore notes as best I can. But, uh... No guarantees for that. No, we're not. Random RNG. Here we go. Bow. It's a worn bow, but a bow is a bow. There's something here, but I cannot activate it yet. What is this? Lunic altar. Um, oh, I can't. I don't have enough for that yet. I guess this isn't the one where you have to hit the buttons to get the secret door. Oh, what's this guy? Hello, pray to this statue. This will allow you to find your way back here from the shelter. 
Oh, all right. Uh... Aha! So this must be it. Secret hidden button. Perhaps? Perhaps this is the secret button we were missing. But I feel like we're at the bottom now, so I don't know... chest and we get what is this ballast guide a weapon is but an extension of the warrior's arm ballast the great faith costs oh oh it's a, another magic uh okay what does this do oh i must just be okay well we can't use that right now, but thanks for the offer, I suppose. Ooh, lore. Saved in the library. Memories of a fool. 2-4. I came to the potion-making room to see my little fellows. The alchemist killed my rat friends. He stuffed them. Stuffed! Fool was crying big tears. I was red all over. Bred like the alchemist who died with his own arms up, up his butt. Who is stuffed now? Poor rats. Wow. That's a lot. There's a lot there. Healing. Okay, well, I don't need healing. Okay. One of the gray things. Oh, come on. You? Oh, why didn't you? You had the stamina. Attack again. Attack! God, it has a, a high minimum on it too. Great. This is going so well. So well. So how do I I guess this wasn't the secret one with the buttons. Look at this weird like like beach vacation Freddy Krueger over here. <sighs> And what? All right, I guess I double minimum damage to that guy. I don't know. That was strange. I've killed literally. I've killed that guy with one hit, and then this time I hit him twice. With that guy. The RNG is very weird. All right. Um. Yeah. Not a big fan of that weapon. It's not bad. It's just. I mean, I don't know. I mean, all we got is the Rusty Gladius, which isn't even what that is, but. 20 to 54. This should just be, I don't know. I don't know. 42, it should just be my best weapon, like 100% at this point. I guess I'll just stick with it. I don't know. That double two hits and it, it's still not dying seemed real, real strange to me. I am really looking forward to having some of the other like upgrade options, like the armors and stuff. Because do I need them? Okay. Okay, sure. Hmm. I don't think, well, wait, it has better armor, right? Oh, well, no more health. Well, so it's worth it. This could probably be a little bit faster. Like you do the prayer and then you just it just opens as opposed to the filling mechanic. Unless like it's supposed to be a, a restrictive thing where it's like uh, oh yeah, you can wait, what's this? Oh a feeble cloak. Yeah, it's better than the rags we've got, that's for sure. 
but uh yeah yeah definitely looking forward to being able to just get some spawn good armor off the off the map I guess we'll take it for now oh that I didn't realize that that no boss thing actually takes up uh, inventory slot Okay, well, that's good to know, I guess. Oh, that was my fault. I didn't realize where I was at. Okay. I think the, what the problem I have with this is the loading times on this one. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> at least this is fast. It's nice of them to just... give it to me and, like keep it kind of saved that's that's a good uh time saver one at least yep that uh oh i well, actually died this time i wasn't sure what to expect there like what's that one i have to be thrown at enemies will be able to follow their smell it creates a toxic cloud okay that's an interesting choice I mean, maybe. I mean, right now I think the only perk I'm running is, um, I think it was the one that I moved 10% faster or whatever, or plus 10 to speed. We'll see what happens though. I mean, visibility is an interesting choice, right? Like, depending on what you're playing, it can be super useful or completely useless. Uh, hello. gonna drop this because the armor build rebuild are way 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 more useful i could see a visibility perk being a little useful in this because i can definitely see them having very like pitch dark caves at some point so just having it on the <laughs> yeah knowing is half the battle gi joe um i don't need this so this one, right? this one. And the other half is violence. Oh my god, it's so slow. Alright, so yeah, I definitely need to, uh, I think, choose a better. I think this is just a little too slow. Maybe just stick with the great sword. Sweet. That crit damage. And this is ruining vault. Yeah, I'll take one of these while we're here, I guess. I mean, OSR, are you gonna at least fire? Oh, it's one of those. What do I get? Oh, it's literally the same thing. Oh, great. Oh, the cure chances are actually much nicer. Are you gonna at least make sure you have your um, red and blue lasers that don't actually hit anybody? And your helicopters that don't actually kill anybody? Oh, that's right. I forgot with this, it's actually better to hold the button down. I forgot about that. Are you gonna get a, a, a sweet, oh. Oh, that was the one we needed. Fudge. Fudge, I declare. Fudge. All right. That's fine. Blessing. Uh, I forget how important it is to memorize these map areas. Okay. Okay, so from here. Oh, we missed it already. 
All right, so for this one, where can I go? I can go left. I can go left into the Afflicted Village, where we have a mission right now. That's where our next mission is. Or I can go right through the boss and down here, where it looks like we've got one path. And well, we can go over here. I mean, I guess we can go to this guy instead. Uh, let's see if we can figure out how to get get back to the afflicted village. Yeah, this thing is very slow to not be able to count on it. Oh yeah, there. This would be almost impossible without. Like, I guess you could just draw your own map, but. That would be so unbelievably confusing. Mm. Yeah. Alright, we got him in two. Oh, we dropped more armor pieces. Nice. Having a bow around is nice just for the, pro the uh, problem solving capability. Okay. What was this? Oh, that's just a Templar shield. We can't even use that. Yeah, I mean, I guess they could force me to go old school and, um, like, hand write the maps. Okay, so where does this one take me? Okay, so this is. Okay, this is where we got to figure out which direction we want to go. We can go up or to the left. And I'm also missing a tablet, it looks like. Like a damage tablet? It seems that this temple is full of advanced mechanisms. All okay, that's okay. This is the one with the, the extra button we have to be aware of. OG Metroid? Yeah, I remember I tried playing that years ago. Um, and I remember it being pretty bonkers. That whole series is pretty bonkers, though, if you actually like... Um, like look up the lore and stuff of it. Sword. Yeah. Oh, come on, he got away this time, huh? Lucky little bugger. Yeah, I looked up the, like the lore of that of the universe stuff. Yeah, it's bonkers. Like uh, the timeline for when certain modules take place is. is insane like uh, there's two or three in a row that take place before the original Metroid and then uh, like a Game Boy Advanced one is the official sequel to uh, Metroid what is it uh, Super Metroid oh, I guess I can't go back I don't remember being the ladder I can go back to Fusion, yeah. There's those ones where it's the 3D ones. Those ones are all like in weird timeline stuff too. Okay, so where did this... Okay, so this is the one that goes up. I guess it was just that first initial like ladder I climbed, right? So this will take me through here. And I don't... Okay, there are a few... 
Oh, that's just a chip sword now. I don't know. I don't know if this thing would even work on that boss I died to. To be honest with you. It might legitimately be too slow. What was that? A, a mountain of flesh? Thank God it chained to a wall. I fled, but the monster miniature hurt me, and it looks pretty bad. Oh yeah, yeah. I already know about that. I don't need your lore. I need this armor. Oh, that's better in every way. Oh, nice! We finally got new armor we can wear! There it is! That's what we've been looking for. Now we can actually wear something that is armor. Okay, we... This is that first boss. I think I knew we gives you a shield. <laughs> oh, so if we come back here, we get that blessing again. Interesting. Okay, so now... Now we can go try to go down, which we haven't been to before. Or we can go right. I guess we can try to go down? Yeah. Oh. Well, that'll be nice. Get this one. That's weird. Is it? It says it's green. Maybe that means I already have it if it's got a color on it? Yeah, instead of decorated trash that I found, you know, outside of a used clothing store, um, I actually will have something that resembles actual clothing instead of just colorful <laughs> trash. Because this way I don't have any um, chance to miss. Or no, additional chance to miss. Thanks. Is that... I don't know how slow this has to go before it stops counting as a weapon. Okay. This. Just keep swinging. All right. right so this is one of the ones you want to dodge behind. Uh, Five percent chance to miss. Damage crits, twelve percent. Stun crits, eight percent. Bar barbaric harness. Uh, but it only has one armor instead of two. No, that's a down a downgrade. I would say. So Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to go this way. Hmm. Maybe I can't go because there's no arrow, maybe I can't go down there. Down here, maybe I can only come up or something. I don't know. But this is definitely one of those ones where if you want something that is not going to hold your hand, it's just going to throw you at stuff. And this is it. There's only one door out of here, so. The door is open. Okay, grab the bandages. We definitely need all the healing we can get. Check for spikes. Okay, we don't need a different horse bow. secret last time oh yeah yeah here's the 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 pendant's whip penitence whip 
I forgot this stuff is uh, not randomized. That stuff is set. What's this? Uh, some kind of altar or something. I have to remember the loot's also set, so you can build a path, like, very easily through this if you really wanted to. Okay, now, okay, this area has a direction we haven't gone yet, which should be to the right, apparently. Archer. Ah, it must be down in this one. Okay. Because I remember doing the double sliding thing. I'll take the armor piece. There we go. No lore here. See, like that time I one shot it. Here's the door. I assume this has got to be the one on the right. Why did they expect me coming from the other direction? I'm not sure what to think here. Oh, I did find something under this one. That's random. I did not honestly think I could interact with that. I was just hoping. Like, okay. Ah, uh, okay. So this is, must be the down one. Okay, that's definitely the down one. So we'll have to go. Let's go right this time instead. I think I can still get back to that door. Oh, huh, interesting that that had some uh, physics to it. The hanging cage. No lore on this guy, it's just a certain robot. Okay, let's go right. Okay, so yes, we're in a new area. The bloody huh. path. Uh, oh, okay, no. I don't need any uh, weird settable bombs. What is that? Hmm, I don't know how I feel about whatever that is. Hold on. There's a ladder back here, right? Faith interacts your stem. Regen. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Luckily, we have the thing right now that if we hit something. Boom. Oh, it didn't go off? Oh, maybe it means it's charged? That should have went off. Huh. Oh, secret. This, I guess these are just bodies hidden in the... Oh, there it is. Okay. Sweet. So we got that one. Proved critical chance. Yes, and then it turns a color. Okay, so when it turns a color, that means we got it. Well, that's good enough. The little question mark on it. Okay, so... Okay, interesting. There's only one way to go. I guess the other thing would have been a secret or something? Percent damage to crits, okay. <laughs> Why? Oh, I'm out of stamina. Wow, even on a miss, I was able to get the kill. Oh, trinket. Okay. Wow, yeah, that's just better. Um, no? I'm not sure what... Some of this stuff looks like it's interactable? Okay, another one of these. I'm not sure what these are, but it looks sort of like summoning a boss or something. It's not what I'm interested in yet. I feel like there could be a run for that, though, where that's the second one of those I come across, and, like, if I can beat the mini-boss tied to them, I, I don't know, get something. 
I think we really like get a cool weapon or something to start out with pretty early. Growling, mumbling. After all these centuries of loyalty, why? Why? They ruined everything you built, Gabe. Look at yourself. God, why, you filthy... How could you allow this? Empty. The temple. Me. You are empty. If I ever see the, these giant jerks, I will make them suffer. Look at them. A walking pile of flesh. And another one made of steel. Ugh. Gabe, you are witty. They will be corpses if I find them. God, why do you ha Why do you hate me? God, why? God, why? Okay. What is this? Oh. Ripped off a Sydney. The badge represents everything Gabe loves and everything he lost. Wow. Like, part of his... Well, I guess he's just covered in gore. Okay. Dirty hood made of various cloth. Wow, it is terrible. It's just terrible. Well, there's some lore for everybody. Huh. Someone named Gabe. Who may or may not have had a hand in building the place. Crusader's Haven. Wait, what? What? Oh. Oh, I'm back. I'm here. Oh. Okay. Well, that seems like a slightly faster and easier way to get here. Interesting. Um, I don't remember how to interact with these or if I can. Yeah, this thing is going to be basically useless against this boss fight, though. Teleportation altar. What is this one? Disease purging stone. Healing statue. Yeah, this is the boss fight. We are probably going to get wrecked real, real hard. I want to reset myself here. I mean, I have armor now. I would only have like one healing item. That's something else I'm a little confused about. Like, maybe I'm not meant to do it yet, but setting this as my spawn point from the statue and having one healing item seems like a really bad idea. Maybe it'll be better after like I win a boss, like clear this boss fight. But right now it's it's a really bad idea. Execution. Shadow of flesh. There is some definite, like... Uh, okay, so if he has the axe over his head, that's when he's going to attack. So there is definitely some um, enhanced range on attacks. Because... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Last week, I was joking that uh, he goes total Rock Lee on me, basically. Stamina regen, okay. Jumping and rolling is less physically tiresome. Okay, that's just stamina resist resistance. Negative five chance to miss. Your actually is deadly, plus five to crits. Oh, there's a speed one. I'm not using it yet. Okay. Armus is business. Shielded holds. Fifth block, you lose so much your foe. Your block. Spell incarnation time. Still critting. Training aim at understanding your weapons and weak points of your foes. Plus five crit for each hit until critting. I mean, I guess that could be good with the right weapon, right? Training aimed at speaking in creation as fast as you as it as it is read. No longer need it. Need a shield if you can block this well with a two-handed weapon. Uh, 
Perfect block equals 100% crit. Well, I haven't been any good at that, so your armor is as resistant as the shield it holds. I guess let's get, yeah, let's get this one. Let's see, maybe the speed will be better. Let's try speed. So every fifth hit is a, or I'm gonna keep getting bonuses until I crit, and then I also have, only the first ones will know the answer. God will know his people. How long have you been part of the crusade? You made an offering to the Lord Creator of the universe? Okay. So we should actually have armor now, right? He can forge his armor. Yes. Damage crits, 6% sun crits, stamina regen, miss 4%. Oh, we have a 4% miss by default though now. Well, that, that sucks. Oh, and I can't turn it off, but all right. So it's better in some regards. Faith cost. Oh, okay, so that costs faith to fire the spells off. I mean, it's like 4% chance of miss. So the fact that we have more attacks better, so like... like yeah, that's a real interesting style with the holding down the attack button instead. Oh yeah, I think we also unlocked the ability to go to the sewers or something. If I remember that correctly. Gloomy cell block, ancient dungeon, gloomy cell block. Crusaders, heaven. Fuck the village. Okay, yeah, I guess not. Right, and this is the one we can't get because we can't get on the other. S oh no, 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 we do have it. That one's colored, so we have gotten that one. This is the one we can't get because we can't get to the other side of that path yet. I can't go here and do a boss, or like do some of the mission stuff. Maybe that would unlock some new gear for me. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Okay, well, were we able to chain stun that guy? Huh. And this has three health instead of two, so that's actually an upgrade. I guess I'm kind of more of a hurry. Yeah, that. I'm really worried about going that way, so we'll just go this way. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, is there. No? Okay. Okay, this is the one with the buttons, which means there should be a... Wait, we can't get back though if we go this way, what? Where? That doesn't make any sense. Maybe there's... How do I go? Oh, maybe not. Maybe this isn't the one I was thinking. Wow, for a fast weapon, that's still a little slow. Seems to be better in every way. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if the reach. The reach was helping. 
inquisition through me here. I've been one of them since childhood. This does not make any sense. There are dead bodies everywhere. I'm frightened. Dead must fall in love with the wrong person. Okay, we've seen that guy before. No! Nothing. Alright. Okay, well. Yeah, this definitely seems like the faster, faster way if you're not worried about trying to go and get all the random stuff. And that other path. Okay, so... We want to go... We want to try to go down on this one. No promises, but... Okay. Oh, nice. Puzzle solving bow. I guess we could try it in a fight just to see what happens, but... I mean, honestly, like... It's so slow, I can't imagine it's going to be useful. There we go, armor. Yeah, okay, so here's where we need to, like... We didn't make it for some reason. Wow, that was different, all right. A blessing altar, sure, why not? Some bonus stamina regen, nice. I mean, maybe the trick is we need to go. Uh... Oh, eh. I mean, we'll probably need it at some point. But yeah, maybe, maybe the trick is like. See, look at how much range that second attack has. Way more than it should. Oh, sure. That was luck more than skill, but we got there. Okay, so... Okay, this one just opens a door, right? That's one of the lieutenants. That's why he's glowing that weird color. Forgot about that. Oh, what did you drop? Wailing mace. This repulsive weapon would scare even the bravest on the battlefield. Interesting. What is this one? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's the, like... What is the stats in this? This is 12, crit is 8. It's slightly better than the other ones, I guess. Uh, I mean, I guess we can give it a shot. I, don't know, I guess we can actually have a shield with this. Bam, bam. over to the afflicted village if we can remember how to actually activate the left path. I think we went upstairs last time. Hmm. Okay. There's no commitments that we can't come back from. second noise was, but I didn't push it. Okay, so it's this. 
Oh, it curses or something. Okay. Interesting. Oh, it's got like a slow curse. Oh, but it doesn't affect their attack range. That's for sure. Yep, he's just gonna... But they do attack much slower. Interesting. I don't know if it's poison or... Ooh, Swihander. It's a little slow. I mean, I guess it is a Swihander. I don't know. I think we're going to try the poison or curse or whatever. The Wailing Mace on these guys. See what this actually does for us. What's this? Oh, just a straight long sword. Cutting through flesh and breaking bones with one blow and single gold is a huge weapon. Okay. Can we get this lore? Journal of a curious man. He's chased by two strange people and stepped on a switch. Oh, okay, yeah. Now let's see what happens when we try this this poison whatever. I mean we passed up two good weapons, so. Okay, so now we're in the cursed village, or afflicted village. So we should technically have a mission here. <sighs> Oh, its range is short, though. I don't know how those are gonna do. Wait, is that gonna unlock like a better? No. I was hoping maybe that would unlock a green set of those. I'll take this. I don't know what's in it, but we're gonna find out. Oh, it's one of these. I don't have this, so... A heal chance? 50? What does that mean? So I got a 50-50 chance of healing every time I hit something? That would be nice. Alright, so we gotta go down. Yeah, we can complete some part of the current mission we've been tasked with here, so... I cannot look down. The attack range on this is exactly as listed. Back. Oh, he's back to normal. Okay. Oh, he got me. Does so little damage, though. I guess maybe it'd make a good backup weapon, like I carry that and use a Swihander instead. Hit him with that and then use a Swihander to finish him off. I don't know if I'm feeling the speed much. Um, what is it? 12 to 21? Four. Ugh, it's so floaty. I guess let's go back to this. We did pretty well with it. Even as slow as it is. Alright. And we got armor, which is something. Wait, is this a new guy? I will fight for their church until I am dead. Well, guess not. I'm wondering I wonder if the the not dying and coming back. Oh, almost died. Yeah. See, like, right there, I hit him. Okay, you're just gonna combo. Okay. Like, right there, I hit him twice for some reason. I just don't know why. Piece of armor's nice, though. Oh, wait, wait. I think there was a... Yeah. 
how can it be so slow? He can literally draw and attack with it faster than I can swing the stupid thing. This thing is just, I guess, a little too slow. I guess I'll just have to stick with the rattle. Don't really like it, but that's what we'll have to do, I guess. Man, it doesn't stun. I mean, that was one good thing. Even the claws had a stun effect. Yeah, this thing, I'm gonna have to ditch it. Ho hopefully we'll come across the axe soon. That axe was a pretty sweet weapon. I just don't remember exactly where it's, I get it now. Everyone's faster than you in this one. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I mean, I've definitely seen, you know, Dark Souls has character some enemies that are faster than you, but they're not usually... Not everyone is usually faster than you with every weapon. Yeah, I think I'll just go back to the giant two-handed mace. It, its reach is just really good. That's why I was able to kind of cheese out that boss as I could hit him further away than he could hit me, which is rare. <sighs> Uh, I'm not worried about that. Maybe I should be, but... Okay, so down here... Take this one. Why am I not... I'm actually moving faster than I used to be, and I made that jump every time I tried last time. Like, that's... I don't know, that's kind of strange. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong there. Oh, well. Moving on. Yeah, see, it has no stun. The claws, like the dual knives, actually have stun effects. As weird as that is. I don't know why a giant two-handed sword has no stun. That interrupted that guy. I cannot literally... Doesn't really matter what it is. Oh, is there... oh. Yeah, it's just this. Um, oh, this is just the bow. Well, we need a bow min at least some kind of bow minimum. on hmm I mean the shield's okay I guess so man we go up we go up that way and we want to go over here and try to complete this mission so we do not want to go upstairs oh, I still have to start the stupid platform Grab the bow. <laughs> I love it said a miss, but it still activates the platform. That's fantastic. Okay. Definitely need a better weapon soon. I wish I remember where that axe was at. I'd go get it again. Because it was it was doing it was putting work. made some strange choices. That's all. That's all it did. Uh, yeah, let's just take the long huh. 
Not that it's much better. It's just, you know. Nothing? Nothing? Okay. Really, they count that rusted sword as green, huh? I feel like I'm being lied to a little bit on that. Afflicted village. Yeah, what I would not give for increased rate of attack. Yeah, see, this at least stuns people. Oh, Lord. Uh, I'll try whatever this is. I maxed out. I might as well throw 20 at this box and find out what happens. Okay. Okay, this is the healing one. Sweet. Okay. Still not 100% sure how those work. It seems like sometimes it's based off hit, and other times it seems like if I kill an enemy, it, it builds up a charge. And once the charge maxes out, I have a chance for something to go off, maybe. Huh. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Just explosives. Just explosives that are very weird and hard to use. Oh, did that open this weird? It did. Aha. Uh -huh. So it's not going up there that's a matter. It's just going through this door, which is actually what that was. Oh, person. Those who let their faith leave will be struck down. Get out of my way if you don't want to get in trouble. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Is that it? I have some bandages. You want a bandage for your, like, multiple giant wounds? Do you want... Oh, wait, can I go down more? Oh, I can't. Oh, it is pitch black down here. What are you? Oh, you throw fire. Okay, you're a fire thrower. Oh, and you can. Oh, and then you explode. Okay, great. You have a lot of stuff going on. Last words of the vote. They told me I was nothing but an experiment. They screwed and hooked a lot of steel into my body. It hurts. They told me this is the p price of for he heaven. Here they come with a ball-shaped helmet. I already feel nauseous from the scent of oil. I'm scared. I repeat to myself that I, that I have to protect the temple. I have to protect the temple. And light, and light my torch when the time comes. I have to protect the temple. I have to protect the temple. And light my torch when the time comes. All right, so this guy was some kind of experiment they used to build something for apparently defending the temple way back when? Approved critical chance. Runic altar. I don't have enough. Let's get out of here. Okay. Hmm. We're in a new room. Ah, oh, it's one of these guys. Does not care. Okay. Kind of straightforward. Another locked door. Another locked door. No! What do we got? Uh, just an old sword. No, no, no. no. Oh, come on. Miss. Oh, another miss. Feeble one's club worse. And ship sword, 26, 72. No, that's generally just worse. What's this? Shines? Oh. Uh, Alright. Uh, just set this down, I guess. What does this do? Oh, I guess it's just like a flashlight or like a flare. Yeah, 
Yeah, it definitely sounds like the origin of the monsters for that uh, flame guy. Pretty sad, pretty messed up. It'll be interesting to see how much lore we can actually get and for what. Aha! Uh -huh. The door. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I guess it would have just let us into this. And another one of those shrines, which we still don't know exactly what those do. I thought that wall looked a little different, but I guess not enough. Wow, I can't believe we actually beat that one. And then this was a plague restoring one? I do have something. I think it's loss of faith? I don't know if that counts as disease, but... It does. Okay, great. prison is almost as large as the city itself. I understand the jails are useful, but why this big? Maybe the bridge has been torn off. Maybe it's all a jail. Maybe there never was not a jail. Come on, that looks like a broken wall. Really? Wow. What is that called? Dead weight. I should have repaired this armor beforehand. The rust is showing me down, slowing me down. Ah, okay. So will this? Oh, that will get rid of it if I repair the armor. Okay. Well, that's something, I guess. Okay. It's probably too many rooms with no armor um, will cause that to occur. Oh, okay. He's dead. Just dead. Got it. Nice. Bandage. Get the bandage. Zombie. Or crawler? What are they called? These? The gray crawlers? Is this a... What is that? It's like a door to nothing? Like it's a jail cell, but it doesn't actually lead into anything. That's kind of weird. Okay. At least I got my stamina regen back. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay. We've got one of those. We got one of those back. We don't need magical smithery. We have magical smithery at home. Alter the magnanimous. I think that's just an item. No, use the ladder, dingus. Oh, nice. Hope this is worth it. I can't remember what these do. I can't remember if these are damage or health. Improved damage. Okay, cool. Okay. Prison key. Oh, oh no. Get out of there. Oh, man. Just gonna wreck me. And the other one. <sighs> so, for some reason, it didn't stun the other guy that time. That's one of those weird consistency things I'm finding very frustrating. Uh, I guess. I guess that could be useful. What do we got? Uh, let's start from the left. Nitrogen aura. A pipe system is built under your leather vest. Nature freezes. A cooling miasma emanates from your armor. Armor slows down enemies? Okay. That's an interesting one. Armor patched up such a way it will look strange but protect you well. Car killing carries a 25 chance to give you armor back. Oof! That's a big one. Holy cow. A viral system drops oil under your shoes and a flint is tied to your heels. How clever. Your steps generate fire. Okay, we are definitely starting to get into the weird pseudo magic. Hand stitched thick leather protects the protects that improve armor protection. 
Wait, what? Hobnailed armor reinforcement. Hand-stitched thick leather patches that improve armor protection. Okay. Okay, that makes more sense. Plus three armor points. That's a pretty good one, too. Yeah, this is getting really interesting. Coated armor. What a strange idea it was to soil one's own armor with oil and gunpowder. Losing one armor points creates an explosion. I assume the explosion doesn't hurt me. I hope. Purged Hamlet, Afflicted Village. The Cloister of the Chosen. Elma the Crow Lady. Wow. Weapon dash dashes deal. Wait, what? Second dashes of daggers, bows, and spears produce lightning. Be careful. Weapon dashes deal damage, stem cost. I think there's some kind of concept of attack I am not knowing how to do. Um, but that's fine, I guess. I, am, I have returned. Oh, well, grants faith when you hit a, a enemy. I could go magic build. I could go magic. Let's just magic it up. Let's go magic style. Magic style. Sounds like it's learning into the practical but cool card. Oh, yeah. This is leaning into a really weird, nonsensical all the way. Uh, what's your thing? Oh, nothing. Okay. All right. So I guess with this, we can go try to fight. Oh, it's so slow, though. It's crazy slow for how short it is. Oh, forgot about that again. You know. It does have quite a bit of knockback, though. Nope, he's just gonna poke right through it. Why would it? Love it. Love every second of that. Yeah, I think anytime you have armor that. Something like that, where it's like, yeah, your armor has a vent in it that freezes enemies. Yeah, I think you're, you're doing a, a little bit of a weird one. Like this? I don't know why this takes so long. Unless maybe that way you can like back out at the last second or something. But generally speaking, it feels like you should just like use it, yes, and then do so. Okay. That second slash isn't terrible, but that first one's a little, a little slow. Well, not even slow. It's just a little short. You have to be, like, touching them to hit anybody. I mean, I get the point is it's supposed to refill your faith, but come on now. Explosives. Oh, the bot. The bot is posted for the Discord. This. Oh, so sometimes, see, certain weapons do have a roll attack. Worse damage crit, but more stuns, and it goes resets our armor. Okay, do you have stuff? Too arky, I think, is the problem. Like, maybe I could figure out a way to, like, save it up. No, 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 no. Pick up the thing. Why? Can I not? Wait, what? Why can I not get this? Oh, I already have one. That. Like, oh, here we go. Damage boost 20 to 30. 
Your eyes get lost in the red glow of this gem. The taste of blood fills your mouth and anger grows deep inside of you. Okay. Yeah, this one's better. That just uh, has ton of, like, 20 to 30 extra damage. I don't know how often that triggers, but... Hopefully enough to be relevant? <sighs> Come on. <sighs> Been a little bit more damage in there, but not much. Not as much as I would have liked to see. Get the armor piece. Like right there. I don't know what I'm doing wrong that I can't make that jump. Because I've made it in the past, and I'm technically supposed to be moving ten, you know, plus ten faster, whatever that means. Yeah, let's grab a blessing while we're here. Why not? Why not get a little bit of a blessing? I haven't seen negative blessings yet, so... Stun grips. Okay. Still a very interesting choice to not let me jump. Oh, I got him with, like, two of them. Oh, not enough damage. Interesting, interesting. If I get that. Wait, what? None of those hit him? How is that possible? Yeah, I don't know why none of those hit him. I guess they just, f like, phased in into the roof? Yeah, low ceilings, I guess. It's just this my ultimate weakness. Okay, so this. I think this guy's a bow. What if we have a bow? Wow, yeah. <laughs> Less than 90 damage and it, and it one shot him. Or killed him. I think that hammer should have been killing him. Okay. So, yeah, sometimes they just aren't hit stunnable. It's a choice. It's an interesting choice. So that just gets the shield, which I don't really care about, generally. I mean, it's better than that piece of wood shield that we start with. But. Okay, so this is the one where we have to choose where we want to go. You see, this one looks like it indicates a book. I wonder if that means we have to find some kind of lore? And then there's another path over here. It looks like it just goes down here. It's a teleporter. go this way. I have to go through there, through here. Here, into this one. Hmm. Get that boss. I don't hmm, I don't know how the boss would go with this with like magic build. Uh, let's go try it, I guess. Is there actually even another path? Yeah, this one has... Okay, this is the one... I think where I have to go all the way to the left to be able to go this way. For whatever reason, I cannot seem to do that anymore. Reasons that are unknown. Ah! So, oh yeah, this is the arrow. What do I think I need to do? So I want to go up. Yeah, I don't need that arrow. Interesting that it takes a second for that to kick back in. 
See, like, is that a crit, a hit and then a crit on top of that? Or is that more of a visual bug? No. Oh, one's dead. I don't know. I'm really not sure. Okay, we gotta figure out what these do. Oh, that's one of those. Okay, so we gotta figure out what this does. Cause I've seen a few of them now, and if there, there's no way these are all summon a monster. Okay, followers armor it has better armor. But worse, everything but crit damage. Well, more armor is probably better. So maybe these just indicate an armor drop? I mean, if that's the case, that'd be fantastic. Okay, so now we just go straight. There should be only like one enemy in this room. Oh, we got him. Got. Oh, you just dropped a chip sword? That's useless. Oh, wow. That was a, a triple. Um, eh, we'll keep the extra armor. For now. What do you got? Oh, what was that? I'm not, okay, yeah. It's just the boss fight warning, which is fine. Who cares? Whatever. We already defeated this weirdo. Okay. We tried to go down, but we couldn't figure that out. It looks like that path isn't available probably yet. Interesting, yeah. We occasionally just get like a double hit for no apparent reason. Oh, and you have. Okay, you've got a torch. Yeah, I don't. I mean, the torch is nice, but we're trying to do a magic build here. Nice. And this is the more precise for a room. No. I think stamina gen is probably better. Yeah. Oh, okay. Back up we go. Sit him again. Oh, oh a triple. I don't know what is causing us to do that, but it is fantastic. Oh, it's this guy. Too much? <laughs> Maybe that's the problem. I'm just dodging too much. Okay. So, okay. Yeah, but learning, I think a big part of how to save time in this is definitely learning uh, those. It's like figuring out the path you definitely want to set up. <laughs> Like, I bet speedrunning this has got to be super interesting.
the magnanimous. Oh, you know what? I just realized where that second hit's coming from. That second hit is caused by the, the um, rune we've got. When it triggers, it just... When I hit something like the seventh time or whatever, what is it, two, four, six? Yeah, so whenever I hit something the seventh time, it just does an extra hit. Okay. That makes more sense. Add on top of that my weird crit thing. It's an interesting build. Probably not optimal, but... I mean, we're, we're doing pretty well for, like, using a fast weapon. Okay, so we could go down. Or you can just go to the right. Anything? Ooh, armor piece. Thank you. Oh. Oh. oh, that doesn't count? You gotta be kidding. I don't know why that didn't count on that backswing, but sure. Nothing, really? Come on. Ow. Precise for a room. This is the one that takes me down. Well, that's fine. What's this? Ooh, yes. All right. Okay. So, we're back into the afflicted village. Okay, nine poultices is the most you can get in a single stack. That's good to know. Okay, well, let's find out what's on this side, I guess. Oh, it's a ninja. I forgot. I forgot. He has a back attack. He's a back attack. Stamina region one, that's fine. Okay. Oh, what is that? A rusty Morgenstern. Tough as a ma ma metal. Wait. Materials eventually die in the jaws of time. Interesting. We got this giant club thing now, apparently. Oh, great. Oh, it has some kind of... Well, it doesn't help much, but... Oh, he's just gonna... Kinda sick of your nonsense. It's got some kind of magical effect. I just don't know what. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Does that cost 10, right? Uh, what did I overheal myself? use so many poultices at once. Yeah, you literally can, if you use too many healing items in one go, you like, 
over over affect yourself and you become no. numb. Fantastic. That's that's I not I don't appreciate that. That is um I'm going to go with not cool. Yep. They punish you if you heal too much. Yeah, this is uh oh, uh, death. Because my character slipped forward. Reduce spell incarnation time. Yeah, this is this is real bad. And people say Dark Souls is bad? No. Armor slows enemies down. I don't know what that means. I guess if they hit my armor, it slows them down. Okay, so I mean Oh, I'm not choosing that way. So spell casting was fine, I guess. But uh, yeah, I don't think it's that great. This one, though, this sounds awesome. So, hopefully I can save up a little bit more and get that. Um, so, magic build. It was fine, but not great. Um... Yeah, let's just go back to this, I guess. Oh, it didn't it didn't produce. Ooh, all right. Yeah, I just I I like the idea of the saving at a, a statue. Yep, that always happens cuz I really Why did that hit twice? But, uh, yeah, so I mean, I like the concept of praying to a statue and then the statue gives you, um, like, a quick way back. But the problem with that is, is it just takes you right back to where you were, but without any of your gear. So, yep. Yep, because... Yeah, no, I'm just gonna call this one. Yeah, start sorry, over. Yeah, the hammer's nice, but it's just so slow. Um, I mean, we just don't have any, like, we don't have a good weapon yet, which is insane to say, but, or anything I like, I guess. Um, I don't have anything better. That's a problem. Yeah, I think the problem with this, to me anyway, they, they either start you at a little, okay, or just stand there. Okay. Um, they start you out, I think, a little too weak to be fun. Like, maybe eventually you'll get somewhere that would be something on the par of fun. But so far, this has not, not been the most fun. Huh. Interesting, that one had some magic attack. I think this is unfortunately just on the wrong side of difficult. I mean, I'm not saying eventually it won't be more fun. It's just right now, it's a little bit of a slog. Until they f give me... How do I explain it? Until I have enough gear 
that using the teleportation, like using these teleportation altar resets is viable. There's just no point. Because I need all the healing items I get on the path there. And skipping it all just makes me weaker. <laughs> Unless there's something I'm not understanding that it, it won't tell me. Yeah, it, it's not really... There's nothing fun with that mechanic. It's a really strange choice. Oh, well. Oh, well. Whatever. Um... I can't remember there was something... No, okay. Like, starting... Like... I guess just the basic attack animations and stuff need a little bit of work in my mind. Um... The... I, I don't know. It, it feels like I'm not understanding something about the combat. Yeah. Like, maybe this was a, originally yeah. designed... Uh, yes. For cell phones or something? I don't know. It's kind of hard to describe. It doesn't feel like it was made with like a PC or, or a controller in mind. It definitely feels like it was designed around something else. Just how long attacks take, even with the fast weapons and... And the fact that your combos are holding the button down as opposed to pushing the button again. Which isn't bad per se, it's, and it's definitely a choice. It's just an odd choice. Like, I don't know what the thought process was to make that, that makes that better than a normal <laughs> pushing the button again, attacks again combo system. Unless maybe it has something to do with what they, their thought process was for combat or whatever. Oh, this guy dropped the bell again. Uh, wait, what? Okay. No, I want the bow. Okay, for hitting the ground with this bell will attract even the deafest of enemies. Okay, and then this stand region, I guess. What does this do? Strange poultice. It cures a disease. Alright. I mean, so we got this bell again. I guess that's something, right? Right? It hits like a truck when it wants to. Like that. It wanted to hit. Well, we'll take this. Can't use the shield. This is two-handed. Alright. Yeah, it's a giant bell. It's a forged iron bell. Handle with care. For hitting the ground with this bell will attract even the deafest of enemies. So it's just a super loud bell. I guess, like, I haven't figured out a faster way to get to this boss fight yet, either. I mean, I could set up my teleporter, I guess, like, in here, but then I just show up with, like, a single healing item and just feel like I'm standing there to get wrecked? I don't know. It's a strange choice. Unless I'm misunderstanding and, like, saving at those altars saves your current state or something. But it doesn't feel that way. A dead ringer there. See, I told you. There's a reason Ika is in charge of, of marketing. So when it hits, it hits really hard. It just doesn't hit very hard. Ow, we're going to roll. That's fine. Like that. At least I'm getting partial damage, I guess. Ah. 
Wait. He didn't escape. Where's the stuff? Oh, it was ripped off. Okay. All right. Whatever. Whatever. Nope. It doesn't matter. And this is just old sword and a chip sword. Each foe killed heals you. Really? Interesting. Yeah, the stamina, it, like, the bell's good. It just... What was that? Okay, a mountain of flesh guy. Okay. Like, it, it doesn't even use much stamina. It's a really... I guess it's just the fact that it has such a low chance to hit. Or a high chance to miss, as the, this is describing it. Okay, so from here, I guess I just need to go right. That's the torch I can't use. Oh, oh see, this one has... Okay, maybe it's yeah. worth it for this one? Hold on, I'm gonna try... We're gonna set it here, because this one has the chest next to it, but it'll give me something when I come out, right? So I'll, I'll pop onto the other side here, and they'll give me a few items, at least try to make my way a little bit. Right? Maybe that's the strategy, is figuring out which one of these is a good idea and which one isn't? Two shot at that guy. Oh yeah, see there is a door up here. But there's no way I could So there must be a something later you get where you can jump or fly or glide or something. Like maybe that's what's last on the level up bar. Definitely, like, you do not need to explore every level every time you go through it, for sure. What? Oh, entering the room gives you a shield. Okay. My armor is deteriorating and it's slowing me down. I should have changed it earlier. Rotten armor. Interesting. Okay. Okay, so this... Yeah, we want to go to the right and then down. Okay, good. So when I bring up the map, I do not stop. I continue to do a thing. Uh, okay, take the armor piece. <laughs> Something, I guess. Uh, this is... Okay, more precise. Trap me, okay, the trap hits me as many times as it wants, okay, and then it throws me into the enemy who then immediately stabs me. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Well, at least we got extra armor now, which is good, I guess. Okay, so let's go grab something, I guess. Yeah, that's what we're gonna, you're gonna use that. Oh, it gives us two healing items. That's not, that's better. Oh, and then we need to take... I will fight for the church until I am dead. Okay. Good for you. Is this the one that sends me back to... I saw you appear in the pans of the holy statue. Your god walks behind you. 
Take care, my child. I love, I will leave this place alive, I swear. Aren't you not allowed to love? Ah, okay, yeah, so it opens, that's where I come out, is at the door. Interesting. That's the holy explosion. All right, so yeah, that was the strategy, is finding one of these ones that is next to a chest, and then I can use the chest to get some items on the way. Wow, that still had some swing on it, huh? I would not have guessed that. Okay, it's this guy. Oh, the trap got him, I think. Nice. I'll take the armor piece. Oh, no, take the armor piece. Oh, my inventory swole. Um... Let's just drop this. Okay. Alright. So, yeah, I can go here and then I just need to keep going right. Okay, well, I mean, this is saving us a bit, right? Like, not a ton, but some amount. Imagine trying to do this right before a boss, though, and just going into a boss with two healing potions and I guess a little bit of bonus armor is something, but not much. How did that hit me? I was pretty out of the way. Damage crits. Okay, we'll take this. Oh, he couldn't jump far enough. He couldn't get there. Okay, so this is where I died last time. It's interesting that there's no, like, run back mechanic. Okay. Wait, where's the other archer? I guess there's no other archer this time. That's odd. I mean, really interesting, but odd. Okay, so that'll force me to go down, which is where I don't want to go. All right, so yeah. So yeah, I think a big part of this is just figuring out your route back to the boss and then figuring out where you want to set up your saves and your quick, like, shortcut teleports and stuff. Ah! It's an interesting choice. Don't know if I like it, but it's an interesting choice. So we didn't go this way last time. Okay. Ah, lore book. Turn of a curious man, three of three. That second mechanism was meant to open a secret door, not kill me. Ah. This chase led me to a hidden room. That book was filled with old, composing books. I'm not sure how long I searched for, but I ended up finding something. This is a stunning discovery. According to some of the statement I found, ancient people were living here before the temple was built. I think humans discovered the remains of an underground city and built the temple on top of it. It might be possible to find these ruins. Ah, so that's where we're going. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, so... Okay, so those... The... the what is it, the Underdwellers or whatever they call those? Those are definitely elves or something, right? Or demons or something? You get what I'm saying? I can't remember what they called them now, but... Um, they definitely had a term for those people. And those are definitely... Okay. 
that. And we activate this. So yeah, apparently. Um, it feels more like this temple was not built in the process of like um, being a worship temple, but more of a like a temple where you sealed away something. No, a Templar sword. It's kind of a classic sword. I'm gonna stick with this. It should be better for the boss fight, I think, because of the range. And we have to just kind of wait him out. I mean, I don't know. Like, it, it seems interesting. It's really interesting the, what they've chosen to do here. Uh, precise for one room. Actually, that might be... than an explosion? What is the explosion? Oh, the explosion is one of those. Okay. Yeah, no, this is going to be way better than the explosion then. Oh, yeah, then this guy. Um, no, the what was that? It's strange that the basic starting idol, I guess that thing does have more health? Maybe that's better? I don't know. I guess if I can find a healing, like, shrine. Crusader, Crusader's Haven. Okay. Um. okay, so there should be that, and then we've got healing statue. Okay, I guess we'll burn it here. this, which gave us nothing. And then this is the curse remover one, which yeah. also we don't need. Alright. Okay, this is definitely faster. So, like, yeah, imagine if you set your, your re quick return here, pop out here, you run over here, and you hit this, and it gives you this. This is going to be useless in the boss fight. Ugh. Ugh, no, I can't even imagine that in a boss fight. That seems so bad. All right, so we're gonna burn this now. Executioner guy. Giant axe. Okay, so he's got two stamina. Sometimes. Put my stamina regen. Okay, that should not have hit me in, even at all, but okay, and he's got to turn around. Uh, the armor. See, it's got a little more reach than it actually looks like it should. try third try not bad not bad not bad not bad at all 
Yeah, teleport into my mace, loser. That's how Electra did it. That teleporting katana wielding jerk face teleported right into her side. The Denica, what? Where am I? Oh, he sent me to the shadow realm. He sent me to the shadow realm. So it does less damage, but no, the number of lives taken by this weapon is beyond belief and has turned it red. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. Now we've got a weapon. Now we've got a weapon. Uh, now I get to figure out what stuff I can actually, you know, interact with here. Now we've got a weapon. Trap in everyone, because we've officially found the weapon of choice now. Uh, don't kill me? Oh, oh, okay. Get the toxic cloud. It's a wall of flame, that could be useful. Interesting, okay, so. Ow, my legs. <laughs> this pet attacks your enemies. Red firefly in a bottle. Interesting. Okay. Okay, so there is a trick to this. Oh, what is that? I don't know what that is. I don't like it. Uh. Oh, you attack like that. Oh, okay, so he doesn't... He's like a particularly aggressive... Uh, uh... Oh, get wrecked, son. Beast Paw. Oh, oh, okay, ripped off fix Beast Paw. It's less health. Just imagining that, that bug flying into people's ears as it attack. Yeah, basically, it's just like... Poking it vigorously in the eye, distracting it long enough for me to hit it again. Uh, three, three, seven, engine, print, seven, print, okay, damage, print. Huh. That's interesting. But I think we're okay. Ah, uh, yeah, here we go. Get some health. Or, no. More stamina, nice, yeah. This guy looks friendly. Hey you, have you met a girl named Jail? She is an, es is an escapee just like me and has hair just like yours. Flamboyant and silky. What nice hair you have. No? Well, too bad. She told me that she wanted to search for it for treasure in the jail area. I hope she's fine. No? Well, too bad. Okay, so same thing. So, you seem like you've been here a while, friendo. Okay, this is a blocked door. Oh, and that's something. And rolling might hurt. Great. I have become a poisoned. And it looks like also more poisoned down there. Yeah, well, I can't go this way yet. Oh, wait, can I just hit this? Yeah, yeah this is blocked. I probably have to help him and then he'll open that for me. If tradition stands. And what is this? Create the toxic cloud. Okay, that's useful. Uh, good night, Nick. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you Thursday. Do some more of the challenge dungeon of uh, Dead State. Yeah. The purged hand. Ah, we're here now. Okay. One of the calls for the boss, one of the bosses was in the Purged Hamlet, so. It's another one of those guys. Can you, will you jump over here? Are you that stupid? No? All right, well, I tried. Uh, two. Oh, they are super quick. Okay. Oh, miss. 
There it is. There it is. What is this? Throwing axe. Ah, oh, it's an item. That's straight out of Castlevania right there. Oh, what are you? I don't like you at all. Ow, you threw, but you hit me with fire. Ow, you hit me with fire again. Oh, okay. Well, your devotion is fading. Well, at least we unlocked a new cool weapon. I almost feel like we weren't supposed to do that yet. <laughs> Den of corrupted nature is now accessible. Oh. Interesting. Okay. But guess who's got a new main weapon? Yeah, let's get rid of that stupid baby rattle thing or whatever. Thing's nonsense. No, 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 no. We're taking the bloody halberd spear. Halberd spear. Slow and powerful, but long range. Yeah, it is. Ladies. <laughs> oh, that's not okay. All right. Um, so what does our map look like now? Okay. Oh, okay. So we've got to blow up. We've got to fight three of those explosives, guys. That's what we need to do. We've got to fight three of the explosive guys for our current quests. So I guess in theory, we want to go to the purged Hamlet as quick as we can. Which, of course, there's no real good way to do it, but... So, uh, we, couldn't, we can't go back. We know that for a fact. Huh. I mean, we can go here pretty quickly and just go down see where that leads us. Let's do that. Let's try that out. Um, I think I gotta go over here. Oh, yeah. Look at that. So we got the mid... Okay, interesting. So we defeated that boss, and that gave us the middle one. Not the one of the other ones. Okay, so maybe there's more of like... And it opened a new section. So maybe there's a main boss and then mini bosses. So this one has three mini bosses. Some kind of mid-story boss. Three and three. So, okay. So, maybe, we, maybe we're maybe we okay. Maybe it's mostly a five required bosses with, you know, a bunch of mini bosses in there, too. Maybe that's what we need to... That's what's going to happen. Really? All right. Well, we'll take both of those, I guess. Those useless explosives. Wait, what happens if I have this? No weapon equipped. Yeah, I just don't have a weapon. Literally no weapon. All right, that's fine. So from here, we can't go down. We've determined this. We've learned this fact. Unless there's some kind of other clue we're missing, we can't go down here. That's not enough to kill it. There it is. There it is. Okay. Turn back up. Wait. Double check the bodies. Because what counts as a lootable body really varies from area to area. Right now, I'm really digging this weapon. I don't know if I liked it as much as the individual hand axe, which I really need to figure out where that was so I can go get it again. Yeah, there we go. Okay, okay it's this guy. He doesn't care about that stuff. But luckily, he doesn't have any backup. We just dodge through and, you know, move on. Yeah, that stupid barbaric harness. Oh! Oh! Okay. We still got the thing on us that lets us leave bosses dead, which is interesting. Okay, so the next room is the one where we need to go down. Oh, 
what is that? What just happened? Oh lord, what did I just wake up? Uh. in place. Oh, the crows are watching you. What? I just got ambushed by a mini boss and spanked him. Okay, Shadow Sight. The Fellowship of Shadows, often spoken of as the King's Third Hand, was handy in discreetly eliminating his rivals. Oh, okay. A door has opened. What? Yeah, this is an awesome weapon. It looks super cool anyway. I guess we'll see how far we get with this bad boy. Um. Oh, the one shot though. Oh, no. Okay, well, I d again, I don't know if I was supposed to be able to defeat that. I mean, I sort of feel like I was just because it didn't, it didn't go anywhere. But at the same time, I think I was not supposed to. I think I just got lucky that I had a super long weapon that could outrange it. I feel like that was more luck than skill, but all right. Too bad I can't unlock this thing at the back of the blacksmith. This thing's awesome. <laughs> Now. Oh, what? It just one shot at that guy. What? What just happened? I'm so confused. I don't know what's going on, but this weapon's awesome. Oh, yeah, the flame sword. I forgot about this. Isidore's sword. I forgot that's where the flame sword is. Can't imagine it was going to do me much good, but, you know. We got there. I mean, we beat the we beat that boss fair and square using another boss's weapon. That's Mega Man style, and that's a classic strategy. No. I don't appreciate your nonsense. Oh, that's a really fast roll through attack. Nice. I do not see that enough. Okay, we need to go down here. I do have to be careful because this is where I died that one time. Oh, I hit some truck. Oh, thank God. That was almost really bad for me. All right. Thank God that works. Okay. Wow. I mean, I can say this. It, I, time is flying by. Okay, this. Blessing altar. I don't have enough points. I literally can't have enough points. Okay. Okay, so now we should be... Yeah, perfect. Now we're here, which is where we want to be, in the afflicted village, and we got to find more of those fire guys. Grants you faith. Um, I guess I'll keep the explosion for the moment. Yeah. Oh, 158 or 156. Yes, please. So I need to go. Wait, can I go left here? Or can I, do I have to come out from left here? I'm sort of confused. 
How do I get here? Okay, maybe I can go down. Maybe I need to go down. So I go down here. That's in the gloomy cell block, which isn't quite what I'm looking for. So I need to go right? Or no, it looks like I need to go down on this side of the thing. Okay. Oh, the two shot. Oh, we're getting there. Oh, it, oh, it's getting there. This weapon is awesome. I was not supposed to win that fight, by the way. Almost guaranteed I was not meant to win that fight. I was supposed to lose that fight 100%. I just happened to have the one weapon I could have that would let me win that fight. I'm just going to die in the jaws of time. Like, there's a reason I got an... I did get an achievement. I don't know if you could... Oh, no, my head's covering the achievements corner. Luckily, there's nothing else in that corner. Actually, so like uh, hello? I don't have any stamina. Uh, can we... I need stamina, please. That was nonsensical. Can I interact with this? It looks important. I guess not. And there's a door here. It's interesting we keep coming across these doors that are locked. And but not coming across uh, ways to unlock them. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get some kind of ability at some point to like jump or glide across distances. Okay, now... Wait, it just takes me there? That's not what I wanted at all. Son of a biscuit. <laughs> you dirty ham sandwich. Um. Alright, well I guess I'll just have to start over from the beginning then. I mean, it's nice that we got this new area or whatever, or this new room, but it doesn't take me where I actually need to go for my current quest. A what? What is this? Hello? I heard that you put a put an end to Ezekiel's suffering young woman. Is it true? I, I have never felt this relieved. Thank you, holy woman. Thank you. Did God send you? You may have granted me a new place in heaven. They call me Saint Gilad here, and so will you. I am an ancient priest sent from the deeper levels. I am afraid I do not have much to offer. I apologize, but here is a small gift. Hmm, I have a feeling that God favors you, don't you think? Uh-huh. We may see each other again if God allows it. Bless you, holy woman. But still, is it a sin to kill an innocent? Even for a good cause? Did you take on my responsibilities and sinned for me? How can we be so blind? I'm still doomed, and so are you now. And I am one to blame. Ex I got an achievement, Ezekiel, a bloodied one. I'm so sorry. Okay. We got a new spell. That takes a while to charge up. Oh, we got a fireball. We just had fireball now. That's a that's a heckin' fireball too. Look at that bad boy go. Pew. Wow. Yeah. New entry in forge. Yeah, fireball. Cast fireball on the darkness. And double effective. <laughs> okay, so and it said we unlocked a new thing at the at the forge. So I wonder if I can bring the spells like my new attack. Man, I really wish we could unlock that axe then. Because if we could unlock the axe back at the forge, that would be an awesome combo. The axe and a fireball? Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Oh, here we go. I attack the darkness. I cast magic missile on the darkness. Are there any hot ladies in the village? Yeah? Well, I want to sleep with them. Okay, so... How old is that? Does anybody know what I'm talking about? 
the old 8-bit D&D theater. Anybody else remember this? Am I completely alone? Am I a madman darking in the dark sounding sexist? Ooh, what is this? Mace of the Storm. Blue and white lightning is the Holy Guardian signature. Oh, magic mace. Well, now if I had that fireball spell, I'd be set. Oh, well. Back to the giant cool site. A door is opened. Oh, wait. Uh, this is stamina regen, right? Hmm. I don't know if that's better or not. I have no idea what I'm getting into here. Ooh, lore. Oh, that looks like a woman's body, like a regular body body. Saved in the library. Letter from a mother, three of three. I have left Edgar where his little eyes, where his little eyes closed. Pulling my necklace in his right hand, running in circles in distress, I came back to the place where he died, only to find his corpse walking around. For the love of God, he stood on his feet, but dead. What is this folly? I have nothing left. I have no reason left to struggle. This is it. Death is coming. Ah, so this is a woman who killed herself, apparently. All right. Well, there was another door there. We did not find the key or like this, the lever for, so want want to that, I suppose. I had forgotten all about this. All about this what? The 8-bit theater thing? Or the fact that this has a story and it's not just me wandering through a, a nonsensical dungeon. Yeah, a bit theater. Mm -hmm. It's a uh, it's a thing. It's a weird thing. It's definitely a weird thing. Uh, one of these. Can I activate yeah. him? Okay, so now. If I remember correctly, if I use this, this should take me back? Oh, it took my weapon! Are you kidding me? Why did it take my weapon? Oh, I've been bamboozled. I thought I'd get to keep my stuff. Oh, come on, learning module. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wow. Bamboozled. I have been bamboozled. 100% bamboozlement. Unbelievable. Well, did I get a new spell or whatever? No. Oh, I unlocked... This is what I unlocked? The sacred Grimmar pages? Why? I can take this instead of healing. What? I guess that's so... If I want to do a spell build, it's an option. <laughs> I can go in on faith. I I was hard bamboozled. Mem uh, do not worry. These are but benign miasma uh, coughs out blood. Yeah, I was just totally bamboozled. 100%. 100% bamboozlement. Yeah, well, there goes that awesome weapon. Because it said when I break this thing, I could go back to the temple. So I figured it'd bring me back here and I'd have all that stuff and I could just start from the beginning. That's the advantage of using it is I can bail out and come back here instead of having to die. But if dying brings me here and that brings me here, what's the advantage? Why would I use this instead? That's that's real dumb. Deep darkness, you are your own. Nobody will come to save you. Outsiders consider you dead the moment you enter the temple. Nobody is waiting for you, and no one will mourn you. Go now. May his chant guide you. So much you know, jerk face. Now, I'm pretty sure Putrid Sewer. Yeah, I can go into the sewers. Who are those people? How long have they been wandering for? Where does this take me, then? Putrid sewers. Oh, this is a whole new area. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. 
Wait a second. What? What is this map? And why did I do so little damage to them? Right. Hmm. A ladder. Boxes, boxes. Donkey. I thought for sure when I dodged that there was a 100% chance I was going to become poison. Okay, so I can only go right here. But it says there are explosive guys in here. That's odd to me. Oh. Okay, just dodge. Nope, just dodge. He's wow. I didn't think he had a follow-up behind him attack. Unless maybe these ones are smarter because they're further along in the dungeons? Well, here's those other spikes. Oh, it replaces that. Never mind. Um. Yeah. Wait. No. Yeah, no, no. Let's keep it. Stamina regen. And explosive piece. Don't eat it. All right. All right. And this was... Oh, that's the old sword. Don't need that. All right. So where does this take us then? Okay, but we can complete our mission here. Weird. This is a very odd map. That does not make a lot of sense. Um, bonsai? Okay. We can get the four here. Filth blood. We were wa waiting on a thin line straight from our feet up to our spine when I saw a beautiful girl from below who left with a slave from above. Filth blood. Spilt blood that nobody will love. Shut your nasty mouth before her and bow. Look at your dirty shoes and be a good dog. Before your master, before your god. Respect. This is honor, said my family. Sickened, she did not even look at me. Okay. I guess that's how they treat treated the people who lived here. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was gonna go for yeah. it. You know? yeah. oh, what is this? Poultice. Yeah. Yeah, this map is bonkers. Ah. These things have a little bit higher armor. Piece of armor, yes. I don't have a bow. There's a lot of interesting art choices I can appreciate. Like, she doesn't have hands. She just has little, like, blocky f fists. And when she's holding something, it just kind of connects to it. It doesn't... She doesn't have a thumb going around it. It's very much like how they do... Oh, hello. What is this? An axe. It's just an axe. And, uh... All right. Well, I'm going to stick with my bigger, better super axe. But thanks for asking. Okay, well, I can't go that way. Wait, where's the... Ex is that the explosive guy? Are you kidding me? Was I robbed again? They can do the best they can with limited pixels. I mean, I guess. So, yeah, I guess you just have to remember where... Wait, how would you... Okay, there is definitely got to be something we get later that lets us jump or, like, interact above like that. Like, 100%. Okay, so where does this take us? Okay, we're still in the sewer. Oh, if we go up, we go into the gloomy cell block. And from here, we can go to this boss fight. Oh, okay. Okay. Interesting. And see, there's this... The gloomy cell block, this path has a book on it, but I don't know what that means. I definitely feel like going through the sewers for that boss fight is going to be better than... Or, like, faster than the other way. All the double. Oh, yeah. Just 
chop them down. Chop them down. Oh, we can just take that guy's hands. I mean, also, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if it's like a limit, per se. I think it's just a, a, a tactical choice, right? Like, understanding where to put emphasis on all what. Where? Okay. Okay, that path goes to somewhere I've never been, and then that one goes up there to that boss fight. So I'm not, like, upset about it. It's just an interesting choice. Oh, is this another one of those crow monsters? I think it might be another one of those crow monsters. Um... Yep, it's another one of these crow monsters. Oh, this one can move. Oh, I'm dead. I'm just dead. Yeah. I don't know. Yep. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Was that an attack? He just moved his arm. Wow, okay, well, Rob. Hard of Rob. Unbelievable with this. Yeah. Yeah, so I just got lucky that crow guy got stuck or something the first time we fought him. Okay, so... I guess I need to go through the sewer again? I mean, I can at least take the sewer. It's a faster move to back to this boss fight I haven't done. Though I don't know if I need to. I think that's just a mini boss. Huh. But I do need to kill those fire guys to appease my sergeant or something. Wait, what? Who is this? Sings? Hmm. Come close, come close, warrior. My eyes be gone, but I can feel your presence. Everyone steps in here with their own personal history, which only matters to the people outside who have forgotten you've let, let go of them. I called the sh I'm called the seer, just like the other members of the shelter. I try to be useful as possible. In order to get close to God, some stop talking, while some go blind or lash themselves. Some form of sacrifice is always necessary. What have you given him, woman? Okay. This looks like nothing I what I heard. What am I to do, Saint Amand? Did I unlock some Oh I did. This is a new area I unlocked. It's a book? No. Okay, so this was literally an area unlocked. That's why I've never seen this before. Okay. The Den of Corrupted Nature. And it just takes me down. Okay. So apparently she gave her eyes. Oh, no, no, wait. I need to go to the sewer. I think. Oh, see, so yeah, here's another door we'll unlock at some point. I guess this might be the... Oh, yeah, look. Like, there's another path over here. So this must be where the nature leads. The nat corrupted nature goes from. And then this is that fourth door there. I'm guessing from the other boss I haven't fought yet. Or haven't defeated yet. Because I have fought him. But I think I've, on what, tried four with that guy? <laughs> Oh, wait, you know what? I kind of need stuff. Oh, they didn't drop anything. Okay. Yeah, these guys feel like they have a, either higher defense or more... Oh, no, they don't have more hit points. They just seem to take less damage. 
They always seem to be taking, like, I don't know. I swear that had a higher damage when I unlocked it. Hmm. Weird. Alright, so from here... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just needed to... Oh, there's the fire guy there. Okay, so I just need to have gone this way. Blows up. And then we get out of the way. A door is opened. A door is ajar. Oh, I picked up a bow. Uh, okay, well, whatever. Oh, I mean, I need a bow at some point, right? I don't remember if this is worth it. Let's find out. Oh, it's one of these. This could be worth it. This always seems to just give you a piece of gear, which is nice. Oh, it's the same gear, too. Okay. Interesting. Okay, so we killed one. So we need one more of those fire, like, torch guys. And then we should be good for the quest. And assuming we don't get attacked by a raven guy again, we should be okay. I'm like, heated up this sword. What's going on? Oh, I, I, I set up the charge. Okay. It's damage isn't really that great, but it's actually fast enough, and... Uh, yes, I wanted to go down here. Okay, but the crows do seem to be randomized. Which is not well, I mean, yes and no, I guess. Nice. Quest completed. Cultus. Cultus. Mark of the Kamikaze. Symbol of pride and honor for its bear, always ready to give their life for their god. Better in every way. Okay. Oh, where's this taking us? Somebody's totally new. Okay, and just deeper into the... It scared the poop out of me. Oh, this connects back up to the afflicted village. Interesting. But this looks like it's maybe two-way? Huh. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Door is open. Oh, there goes my stamina regen. What is that? From a deep wound. That's just a shiny. What does this look like? Oh, okay. I just literally glow. Oh, that's a bad guy. I didn't realize what was going on there for a second. I was looking at that altar. Let's grab another blessing while we're here. I feel like they're kind of setting up a boss fight. I don't know what's going on. Uh, go through this. Stand regen or a damage boost. Um, damage boost probably fine. Yeah, where is this taking me? This might be some kind of boss fight. Oh, yep, it's another boss fight. Marty the Shredded. Martyr the Shredded. Okay. We found another boss fight, team. Everyone strap in for this one. Oh, look at this thing. Martyr the Shredded. Okay. Oh, I think I dodged there. Oh, I didn't dodge on that one. He's got a hook. He's got... Oh, he's got a lot of range. Wait, that hit? Okay, 
that's... Try. Got there. To shield? Oh, that's awesome! Pairing may hurt you. Nice. Cool. So we got an awesome magic shield. The ladder looks or organic while remaining heavy and rigid. It can change its shape to become a shield. Oh, and it's a lantern. Well, it doesn't glow at all. Oh, that's awesome, though. Cool. Well, that's another boss down. Another one bites the dust. So right now we're averaging about two bosses a night. And I've got, what, two out of four first tries? I feel like I'm doing pretty good. We're still in the sewers, though. Ooh, I need both of these. Thank you. I'll take that one, too. That's one of these. Oh, come on. You're not supposed to have a back swing attack. Jerk. Nice. Crit damage or crit chance? Crit chance. Okay. Good thing I stopped to look at this. Okay, I'll take another poultice. More zone. How much further do these sewers go? Holy cow. At least it's all zombies for the most part. Occasional uh, barbarians. Right? I'm not worried about that. Ten. Why is this one cheaper? What's the trick? Oh, it's one of these guys. Oh. Mark of the Kamikaze. Okay. Oh, I like the one I have better. What's this? So it teaches you to make much about the use of poisons and their effect on animal psychology. What does this do? Oh. I can just shoot out a poison cloud. Wow, we were pulling someone straight out of the D&D uh, magical book there, eh? Poison cloud and fireball, or bolt. Either or. Oh, wait, wait. There's a path down somewhere. Hold on. Oh, okay, that one's the path down. So this has got to go... Okay, this one goes up somewhere. Does it tie into the gloomy cell block? Okay. What did that accomplish? Nothing. Odd. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah. Oh, okay. It's just another one of these. 
definitely one I call my favorite enemy. Boom. Okay, and creates an explosion. What is this? Saber of Sorrows. This blade belonged to a fallen captain. Use it with bravery. We clear its name. Okay, so it's a basic sword. Nothing wrong with that. I guess thinking about it, it is possible that you would have come here after defeating that first boss and opening this door and been doing all this instead of getting this cool uh, halibut thing, right? Okay, wait, where are we going? Oh, you know what? I think I just realized that All of these are paths back to the main boss. I don't know why I didn't put that together before. But there's four paths here to the boss. So there's one through the sewers. There's one through the cell block. There's one through the afflicted village. And one through the, like, the bloodied paths. Interesting. Huh. Ancient dungeon, yeah. So we're going through the ancient dungeon. What was this called then? Ancient dungeon, the den of corrupted nature. Okay. Yeah. I cannot believe I didn't put that together sooner, but here we are. So if I go down here, that might lead me to this, the Crusader's Haven. If I go up, it looks like it'll probably lead me up here to the gloomy cell block? Hmm. Hmm. Well, let's let's uh let's go to the cell block, I think. Oh no, we are still got more suits. Okay. Ah. This goes up. Oh, does this lead up to the bloodied path? No, there's got to be another room here, right? Yeah, this connects to another room. So, yeah, there's definitely another room here. <laughs> yeah, see, we're on... the Now we're up where the lights are. So we're actually... Moving upwards towards... Back towards the surface. Interesting. Take stamina potion. <laughs> wow. That is dramatic. Explodes too. There's a lot of stuff that just randomly explodes down here. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, so this one leads up into this other room. So this should connect to the cell block. I think there was another ladder down though. Nope. Oh, Alright, so yeah, this is a pretty straightforward room. It's also interesting, you really don't have to fight this most of this stuff. Oh, hello. Uh, repair the armor and deep wound. Okay. Hello. You, again? I thought I locked you in that cell. Oh, you are not that little red-headed thief, are you? I'm so sorry, my lady. The temple sometimes really messes with my nerves. I hope she is still rotting where I left her. Aha. What? Oh, you again? What do you need? No. How long have I been walking inside this crave for? I don't know. I'm on my own. I lost them. I lost my squad. They are surely dead by now. I'm sure you would like to avoid such a fate, right? Some little butt recently tried to steal something from me. It was mine, so I put her in a cell. That will teach her. 
I jailed the beast with her precious item. Eh, eh. She wanted them. Now she has them forever. I hope they're, they were worth it. I don't care. If you find her, let, let that thief rot where she is. Do not trust her. Understand? Understood, soldier? Oh, well. Aha. Well, I like you. Move on now before I lock you up, too. Hurry up. Move. Ah, scallywag. Move on now before I lock... Okay. Uh, healing. Interesting. So, yeah, this leads up to the, the cell block. So now we know what happened to that guy's friend. She apparently, he got, this guy put her in a jail cell. I guess we gotta find her in one? Oh, there was nothing in this chest. It's the first time that's ever happened. Oh wait, this is new. Temples, the temple's cattle. Here's a statement you might ignore. We are wandering here. What are we waiting for? Stuck with no exit, no redemption possible. From from below, we are of course not suitable. Listen, people. You have to realize, people. What are we are cattle, and these are all lies. Rise, rise. It is time for an evolution. Rise, rise. It is time for the next revolution. Oh, interesting. Okay. So I was wondering, I guess that means some of this was sort of set up. This door's locked, okay. As a. Not as a. Oh, hello. So yeah, this was sort of set up as also sort of like a. a, a, a I don't know if slaughterhouse is the right term, but. Oh, like a holding pen for the food for the people below, I guess? <laughs> nope, what I'm wearing is better in every conceivable way. Yeah, hopefully we can find her before we call it for the evening. So it seems like, yeah, me beating the executioner when I did. Um, was probably a little faster than was intended. I can't tell which one of these are ones I can unlock. I think I can unlock this. I can't. Okay. What is this? Oh, left elite earring. Gloomy chant echoes in your ear. Wow, that's really good. Every single enemy is now an elite. Oh boy. Okay, well, you know, that's what I get for getting a good <laughs> earring, I guess. Let's get out of here, team. Interesting. So every enemy is now in the lead. Huh? Well, I have to leave. Um, I guess I can just teleport back out, right? Like, we kind of know what we're doing now. Now that we kind of understand what's going on and how this works... So, what's the fastest way? Looks like, I guess the gel, or we go to three, yeah, we go through the one, two, three levels of the uh, sewer, and then we can pop up into the gloomy cell until we can find the redheaded lady. And there's this other boss fight we can do. This is intriguing. It looks like after we beat him that'll probably lead us into a room that then leads us into here hmm okay because I, mean, I mean going this way isn't gonna do us any good we already know where that leads us and what it where it takes us and stuff yeah 
All right, yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll exit. And then we can start over. Plus I can talk to the guy. Oh, there we go. The afflicted village is now accessible. Okay. Weird. It's not what I thought they were gonna do. Uh, what do I got? 128. Your steadiness generate fire. Killing carries 25 chance to give you armor back. Ooh, that one could be good too. I like starting with armor more for now, but once we have some better armor to start with. Filth Blood Library. Um, once we have better armor to start with, that actually might be better. Not much better, but a little bit better. What's this? The Holy Temple seems to be abandoned. I don't understand. I, I mean, yeah. Nothing? Okay. Let's go talk to these weirdos. Be able to find the divine light. Was that... Did I do it right? Oh, it's just a look at it. The Holy Headstone. Okay, so... Crit chance is up to plus four. Stamina is plus 30. We need another faith one is what we need. Hmm. So I guess this is just in general. Well, one, two, and three. Okay, so maybe there's three chapters or three areas, right? So we've got this top area with the village, then we've got the unnatural den, and then probably the area that has the the, the high bloods in it or whatever. I'm guessing is probably how this goes. Okay, there's the ancient dungeon regular. I gotta talk to this guy and get a new mission. I've heard of your exploits. Good job, Templar. I forgot to say those can get suicidal. Ah, here's your reward. This quest is quite special, Templar. Our manpower has been reduced to dust. I will pray for your soul. Open your ears. Hold on. Sorry, something was... I don't know what that was. At the end of the ancient dungeon is the master of the place with a charming name, the Executioner. Shatterer of flesh, hmm, slay him. May God's chant guide you. At the, uh, um, yo. Been there, done that, he's a sucker. Handled it, done handled it. Yo, 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 it's done been handled. Is that really my quest? Yeah, I already beat him. See, look, he's dead. He's dead, Jim, he's dead. I guess we gotta get there and then go into the room again? Or do they want me to like start fresh and fight him from blank, like from the beginning? So wait, what did I get? Oh, I got a new potion. I can start with a stamina flask instead of a healing flask. Wow, thanks. Oh yeah, here's the new shield. Uh, toxic club book, yeah. But no fireball book, huh. That's strange to me. I guess, can I take that off and then like this? Oh, I can, okay. Interesting. So I guess I'm really, maybe if I go into the dungeon and then come back, they'll acknowledge that I've already done the thing they've asked me to do. Hopefully. So you just want me to master the place with a charming name, Executioner Slatter of Flesh. Hmm. Slay him, may God's strength guide you. Okay, yeah, I've done that. Remember, soldier, your shield does not protect against elemental or magical attacks. We are going to die in here. The captain told me so. 
power has been witnessed. A new path opened inside the full flood shelter. Okay, so afflicted village. Would we just start here then? Huh. So where would. Okay, this probably just leads here and is a different exit. Interesting. Okay. Let's go find out where this takes us, I guess. Nothing to say. Oh, okay, no, there's an actual whole new room. Okay. <laughs> well, I wish I would have gone over there. Sewers do seem to take a little bit less damage. Not much less, but a little bit less. Huh. Ah, well, there's a switch I could have, a door I could have opened. So good. Yeah. That dark pirate blade thing. It's given exclusively to the temp temple's disciples. Despite being ancient, its thin edge remains very sharp. Okay. So is this also another? It is a new one. Okay. Interesting that. interesting that they chose to give me this after the sewers. Letter for, from a mother, one of three. I'm not really sure how long I've been lost in here for. Where, where am I exactly? Why am I even with it for writing this? Maybe to confess or to leave some trace of the doomed world? I was with my child, Edgar, who is gone now. We wanted to flee from the Inquisitor, so we took refuge within the temple in hopes of finding forgiveness and protection. All we found was grief and sorrow. Have I brought my own child to this devil's nest, hoping for us to be saved? Edgar, Edgar. Is Edgar the name of the the one-armed giant guy? It was, wasn't it? I guess that explains why he was a child, because he was someone's little kid before he got turned into a zombie or whatever. I mean, I know the name Edgar sounds familiar from somewhere. Oh, it's another one of these crow guys. Come on now. Why are they suddenly start showing up? Oh, I just realized the the crow guys. The crow guys. The reason they're so tough is because they're those the people from down below. They're literally that anime guy I fought at the beginning who killed me. Son of a gun. What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, he's in teleport. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Beat him. Oh, get wrecked, fool. 
What a terrible, terrible time for that to happen, though, because it's already 8.30. Okay, what's... Uh, I got one more direction to go in. Well, at least the good thing is if I can defeat these things, they give me an awesome weapon. Uh, actually, I do need this. Okay, well... So there was nothing down here. So if I can defeat the, the crows, the assassins, the third hand of the king, I can get one of these sweet sickles, or scythes, or whatever. Which is cool. Okay, so this is the one we've been in before. Oh god. Just obliterated him. Just chunked him out. So yeah, if we can defeat the crow guys, it's great. But boy is it hard. Oh my god, we one shot both of them. It seems not okay. What was that switch for? There's nothing down here. Well, we have two paths we haven't gone through on this area yet. I guess we can try these and see where they lead us. Just to do a little bit more map exploring. Yeah, see, I can't even get over there. Oh, that's the wrong spot. Okay. Uh, slow chance, seventy percent. Nice. Oh yeah, that's better. Elites will not... Okay, so we found the other earring. The opposite earring. Interesting. Oh, some holy pages. Okay. Hold it down. This is Wall of Flame. I don't think I've actually used one of these. Okay, so there's a door. Yeah, and I had to come down this way. So I guess this will take us to some place new. Some place we haven't been before. What's behind door number one? Okay, yep. Oh, we can get a tablet while we're here, though. Can't interact with any of this. Oh, there's the tablet. Yeah. Oh, this is a wall, though. I thought that was a tapestry in the back. I've been bamboozled again. Invisible bamboozlement. I don't know what these things are, but I feel bad for them. Legend of Bones. This heavy weapon seems to be useful for crushing skulls. Ah! Ah! Oh, it's their weapon. Okay. That's interesting that most of the enemies seem to, at one time or another, drop their primary weapon. Ah! Like, as a loot item, I guess I should say. Okay, we can set this up. Alter the Magnanimous. Oh, we found a person. Hello. Please, leave me be. I came here to find knowledge. Nothing more, nothing less. 
You're not going to kill me, right? Heavens forgive me. You suddenly came out of the shadows like a, a horrible rat. For a month, I thought, anyway. For a moment, I thought, anyway. I'm seeking redemption, and I can only reach it through knowledge. Or at least I'll be distracting myself while awaiting death. Well, after closer inspection, you seem like a fine distraction to me. Ahem. I am trying to open a library in the shelter. You should pay a visit if you make it out. Little mouse, have a safe journey. I'll see you then if I don't get caught on my way home. Have a safe journey. I'll s okay. Uh, mildly worse armor. Yeah, mildly worse armor, I'd say. Old medical report, 518. The deeper levels are more subject to blood mixing problems since the high majority of their inhabitants refuse to mate with the filth blood from higher levels. I must say, I understand this choice. And obviously, the king does not want jerks or disabled children. We need to solve this problem with haste. Dr. Kaval, nursery head supervisor. Whoa, okay. So, the deeper levels are more subject to blood mixing problems since the high majority of the inhabitants refuse to mate with the filth blood from higher levels. Okay. Old Medical Report 617. Mixing the same old blood is, is soon going to be a threat to the temple and its people. Generations of disabled babies are being conceived, and they're not welcomed here. I've heard indeed that some of the nobles are very fond of such dishes, but of course, this is not satisfactory nor useful enough. We need newcomers as often as possible. Women, especially. Dr. Call, nursing head supervisor. Wow. So yes, this is 100%... This is a temple set up to, hold on. I want to make sure. Scrabbled by hand, etching traits. Wait, enchanting trees, enhancing trivial items, dream catchers, pierced lights, lanterns, enchanting weaponry, enchanting humans and corpses, unreadable. Uh -huh. Scribbled by hand, unholy treaties, vital force absorption, preventing, prevents aging, restores strength. Lethal threats to the subject does need, the cost is unreadable. Oh yeah, so this is... Oh, I did find a body. No room. Uh, let's try this. Oh, okay, it's just like a Molotov cocktail. Sweet. Okay. Um, oh, did we miss the tablet? somewhere hold on let me go see if i can find the tablet so there was another door right or was it just this teleportation statue well there's this that's a lot of like an old broken door uh, i guess not huh i guess it was someplace else well at least we know it's here and vaguely how to get back to it All right, so we'll take that door. So yeah, this was definitely 100% meant to be a area for storing humans to feed to the upper class creatures that live underground or whatever. Oh, what is that? Uh, like this. Visible, the erratic. Oh, okay, I found another boss fight. Okay. Oh, come on. I healed. Alright, so we found the other boss fight. Jezebel the Erratic. Let's see. It's interesting. Wait. Oh, okay. She's up here. Oh, and that leads directly all the way over there. Okay. So... It's the fast way to get to her. There really isn't much of a fast way to get to her. Yeah, I'd have to just go through here, I guess. Hop down here and go this way. 
Like, this guy can take the sewer path. So it's one, two, three, four areas, basically. Which I can get back to him pretty quick, then. But this one, yeah, minimum of what? Six? One, two, three, four, five areas minimum? Hmm. Yeah, and there's not really a... Well, no, because that's that leads only into here. I can't go the other direction. Interesting. Okay. Well, we found all the mini-bosses now. And they're still not counting me has defeated this for the purposes of the mission. Apparently. Which is bonkers in and of itself. Purged Hamlet. Yeah. Yeah, so. Oh, yeah, we can actually go check this out here. We'll check this out before we leave. The Filth Blood Library. Achievement unlocked Little Mouse. Filth Blood Library. Yeah, so our religion is definitely a lie. Oh, what is this? Lost page from a saint. I've never really disappointed bap defense baptism, although I am allowed to do so. So I could not release the suffering beast. It was my duty to let it let it into our church. For all our growling, dark devotion, and everything I believe in, please do not judge me, for I had to. Though the though the thought of it kept me awake for days, so I decided to approach the night approach during the night when it was unconscious. Like the beast for a while, this mountain of sleeping wounded flesh seemed to be sleeping like a baby. Meanwhile, deep inside, sadness and disgust reached their peak. A cushion was haunting me during baptism. What kind of spirit lives in there? Perhaps a mutilated child? I chose to name it Ezekiel. I never thought I would ever feel the lost in my entire life. I confess I went to him tonight to put an end to this madness. When I saw it sleeping so peacefully, I simply could not follow through. Please forgive me. I hope someone will be will have the strength to do it. Bless you, my child. Ezekiel's Baptism by St. Gillard. Last page from it never really dispensed. But okay, so that's an, okay. that comes back. Memories, memoirs, memories of a fool. Yeah, I don't know, ex like, I think Ezekiel was that first thing we fought, that first mini-boss, right? Letters from a mother, so we're missing part two of this. A lost poem. Journal of a Curious Man. Papers, more books. Oh, and this one should go in there with the others. Hmm. So you finally came. I'm glad. Sorry if I did not hear you coming, but you're quite stealthy, which is a priceless virtue for a librarian. Welcome to the Great Temple Library. Well, I mean, what's left of it? Outside, I was deprived. This is a rebirth for me. Since I am too scared to fight, I chose to collect and classify everything I find. Thank you, little mouse. Here, I will classify everything you find, and you will be able to read it whenever you want. Isn't that fantastic? Sure, it will be useful for the both of us. There exists a lot of secret texts, most of them long forgotten. If you find anything, please bring it to me. I'm becoming too weak to do this myself. Temple is a true gold mine, you know. You look like the kind of person who cares about old books and ancient texts, too, right? <laughs> Temple is a true... Okay, yeah. Huh. All right, so yeah, so basically what we've found just within this first area, which is a lot of lore to drop in just the first area, but I guess they're setting it up. False Eden, part one, important on the conference of the first parish, unreadable. Origins are and will likely always remain a mystery. Man was, is, and will always be. The same applies to the holy temple. It is the light that our environment and species sit within our minds. Okay, how do I, oh, there we go. Two. Myths sparked curiosity within the first parish. I'm the opinion that these are more tales and legends that describe the history of our gods. Indeed, are what blasphemy, what a mistake. Okay, so while they haven't said it directly, there is some implication that basically this temple was built on top of another kingdom that and has, has basically been designed to be a prison slash holding cell 
where we just ship um what's the term where we just ship um orphans basically to have them get fed to whatever this other species is below it's kind of weird Yeah, there's a lot of implication that, uh, yeah, our our religion is kind of a setup, it seems like. So, quite special, Templar. Our manpower is being reduced to dust. I will pray for our soul. Open your ears. The end of the achievement. Ancient dungeon is a match of the charming name of the execution. Okay, so, yeah, apparently we need to... Unfortunately... You're not going to leave without any weapons, are you? Meet up with the bones. He may have some equipment for you. So yeah, apparently I just have to go and fight that boss again for it to count for the quest. Even though I've killed him. That's dumb. That's dumb and lame. And that means there's a weird emphasis. Hold on, though. Luckily, one thing I did do... I think... One, two, three. Yes, I did actually, thank God. I did leave this here in a decent place to go fight him again. So if I go... What did I use? I used the other... The, this guy's special weapon. Azik, the Baptized. Yes, this is Azik, the Baptized. So this is Ezekiel, the guy that Saint couldn't put down that was like a giant creature of a being martyr the shredded we've got who's this way adonis the king's envoy oh adonis adonis yeah the king's envoy he might actually have some more lore he can give us for what's going on jezebel the erratic because we don't know anything about the king we, the one thing we've got is the note about the king. Um, or no, it was the note about the lore of the the, the crows. Ancient dungeon, 87%. The Jezebel the Erratic. Okay. Yeah, so we've got some stuff left to do. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, we're going to turn this off. Confirm. Whoop. Let's go back over here. And get that shut off. Oh. oh, so it looks like the achievements also have some lore. Hold on. Um, Ezekiel, a bloody baptism. Gilded dragged you into his blasphemy by waiting to free this innocent beast from its chains. I guess we're defeating... Wow, that's a 9%er... 9.7% of players have this achievement. Ezekiel, a bloody baptism. Weird. All right. I mean, defeating a crow, only 20%. A fifth of all people have defeated a crow. Well, that's pretty crazy. All right. Okay, so let's wrap up. Um, let's see. What did we learn? Um... The temple, uh, the, mm, that's more lore stuff. But when do we, we got to learn a lesson. What do we learn? Um, uh, reach, weapon, understanding, under, understanding, weapon, understanding range. Let's say understanding range is very important this evening. Um, let's see, what else do we got? Oh, ladies, enter, are you going to sleep then? Okay, sleep well. I hope you come back on Thursday. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Let's see. So, understanding range is important. Um, uh, not pathing. What's the term? Like, I think we've done maps before, but... Like... 
setting what is it why can't i remember the term for this where you set up a map you have a map pa like pathing like it's not map reading it's like journey uh what's the term cartography not cartography but like the ability your ability to look at a map and plan a route like route planning route planning yes just route planning route planning was super was also super important route planning um let's see what else um oh leveling up uh like use <laughs> use your levels uh use your xp use xp because having those extra shields to start off with just having three extra shields at the very beginning is great and then being able to switch over to one of the other ones where it's like every time i kill something i have a chance to get armor back or whatever would also be great once i have better starting armor base armor um understanding range route planning us use us use xp and don't use that thing that warps but takes weapons <laughs> yes uh, <laughs> uh understand your uh under uh understand let's not do another understanding range but uh know your gear know your gear i don't know if i've used that one before but know your gear and what it does because that sort of was bad it was bad and i didn't appreciate it at all all right okay so we got understanding range route planning use your xp and know your gear i think that's good i think that's a good one um okay so we got that done uh now we got to do the pitch um so please join us over on we got the discord discord link is in chat and on the info page um, please join us over at Raven Hillbrook Inc. at uh, on the YouTube repository link in chat and on the info page. Uh, follow us on the Twitter at Hillbrook Inc. on Twitter where we put out updates about what's going on. Mostly right now with the streaming stuff, but also general random company nonsense. Um, yes. Um, next week we will continue this 5:30 p.m. Well, actually. I'm going to try for a little while at least to do my best to try to start a little earlier. Three hours is just not enough for certain learning modules. Like this one seems like it's going to be a little bit longer thing if we're actually going to finish it. So I might for this, um, I'm going to try to push the start a little earlier on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So Tuesdays I'm going to try to start at four and Thursdays I'm going to try to start far at four. And that'll be next week. Uh, so this Thursday we'll stay at 5:30, and then the week, the Thursday after that we'll switch to 4, 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Um, but yeah, we'll continue playing through this. I mean, I guess I'll just try to finish the two boss fights and the mission by fighting a boss again. The bosses have not been crazy hard so far. Of what? Of five bosses I've fought, faced. I think two of them I one-shotted. One of the, the final boss of the whole first region I third-shotted. And I could probably take uh, Jezebel with a little bit, if I had a little bit better gear going in, probably take her pretty quick too. I don't, I don't know how much damage I was in, but I was hitting her pretty hard. So I think it was going pretty good. Um, and then Thursday... Our tactical Thursday, where uh, we'll be doing Dead State Reanimated Edition. We are in like day 68 of 80 for that. We visited every location on the map except for two, I think. No, one, I think, is all that's left at this point. Um, we have, we've dove in. Last week we started the final challenge dungeon, basically. That is a big. Uh, standalone mission in the outskirts of Austin where we're just fighting mercenaries the toughest enemy in the, in the whole learning module and we're just going through like eight floors of fighting those oh and just back to back to back to back to back so it's just challenge dungeon all the way we'll probably punch through another like three or four of those uh, this Thursday maybe more depending on how fast how it goes maybe if we really rock and roll it'll go quick um, and then Saturday 
we are continuing our playthrough of Pathologic Classic HD. The first one was a complete and crazy trip. Definitely go check it out on the YouTube. A lot of weirdness going on there. As promised, as expected, as was delivered. Weirdness. Um, there's more magic in the universe than I was expecting. I was expecting a, something a little bit more grounded with like edges of magic. But there's a lot more just blending of magic into everything than I was really expecting. Not a bad thing, just not what I was expecting. But yeah, that'll be at Saturday, um, 3 p.m. Uh, and that'll be the immersive, a.k.a. no face cam stream, horror stream, where we usually do something with a little bit more of a horror, f scary element to it. Not, not you know, something, it, they can vary from like, like we did uh, Resident Evil Zero all the way to um, Dead Zone. No, not Dead Zone. Dead Zone? Kill Zone? Ladies intro, what's the one you're playing through on Fridays? The one with your friend? Dead Space? Dead Space, yes. Like Dead Space, which is much more action-y, but still falls sort of in the horror genre because of the dark, dark and spooky tones of the whole thing. But yeah, that'll be on Saturday. We will be playing through Dead Space. Yes, okay. We will be playing through uh, more Pathologic Classic HD. Um, and of course, we always appreciate all the likes, the follows, the subscribes, all that stuff on all the different social media aspects is always greatly appreciated. I mean, I'm just a lonely intern here working for free, doing my best to show all you beautiful board members where your where your money's going. If you ever, if we if we ever start being able to tip me or you know, give me a pay raise or whatever. Um, okay, I think that's it. I think we got it all covered. Join all the social media, all the other shows and stuff we do, and wins and times and whatnots. Uh, yeah, so with that, if you need a well-thought-out solution, you need a thinking solution, a Raven Hillbrook Inc. Thinking solution. I am Intern Zeltier. Board members, I really like love that you are here. I appreciate it so, so much soon hopefully i can make affiliate and we can get some emotes and stuff it'll be great but until then at least for tonight i'm gonna go ahead and just clock on out because i am tired uh, have a good night bye